Ridley High School football players are making a racket on the tennis team. Jenna, you caught up with the group. Did they have any experience playing before the season? Not before joining the team, Haley. The sports seem as far opposite as you can possibly get. But whether they've played tennis for two months or two years, they're all glad they joined. You know, one of my friends from football, you know, I just went up to him, I was talking. He tells me, you know, you, know, you should try doing tennis. I used to play uh, Little League baseball. It would be kind of similar to that. I just decided to try something new. Once the trio decided to serve up their tennis careers, they had to tackle the basics. Let's get the ball over the net first and learn the game and improve in these areas of strategy. And then we'll kind of try to really get into some high tech stuff. In total, five Gridley players have switched out of football for a tennis ball. And as you can imagine, there are plenty of differences, especially with the mental aspect of the game. You can't really like show people how frustrated you can get because then at that point they'll just see, oh, I'll just keep doing this and you know see how it goes. There are some similarities of playing between the sidelines and the baselines. Their football training has absolutely helped them here because of their ability to react quickly. They, you know, see ball, run to ball, hit ball. Well, it's much like, you know, seeing a linebacker or seeing where the pass is. Many of these players are surprised they fell in love with their new sport. I've gotten a lot quicker, surprisingly. Like, I can get to the ball really quick, and I'm really proud of that. I've gotten a lot better since my first year. Um, my serves have gotten a lot stronger and have been more accurate. I've been able to aim my shots better. The Bulldogs only won one match last season, and this year they've won five, so significant improvement. And Coach Moffitt says he believes the team will be even better next year.